Good morning, 9 a.m. Welcome back. Hope you guys are well rested. Fireworks didn't stop till about 1.30 in the morning last night. Just struggling a little bit. No worries, we'll start that warm up soon. A lot of Tabata, but we are gonna finish with a nice 12 minute Imam. I'd let you know so you can prepare. Hopefully you won't get anyone canceling right now. All right, let's start that warm up. You guys will need a chair and dumbbells. That's all the equipment we'll need, mostly body weight and a med ball if you have one, all right? Hey guys, watch the clock. Let's get after it. We'll start nice and slow. All right. Starting with squats, of course. Nice and easy. Feet flat. Chest up. Let's get nice and deep into that squat, keeping those heels down. Try to take a breath with each rep. Next, we got knee hugs. Bringing that knee straight into the chest. And let's roll the ankle around a little bit and then drop back down. Ten seconds. Make sure you're balanced before you switch. Good. All right, quad stretch. Grabbing at the ankle bone, not the toes. Reach up with that opposite hand and then push up onto the tiptoe. Get balanced and then switch. Five seconds. All right, we're gonna head to the ground, alternating calf stretch. Pulling with the opposite foot, pulling that heel down to the ground, and then switch. Remember, you wanna feel that stretch all the way from your Achilles up to your glute. Trying to keep that leg straight. Let you all the way down. Continuing to breathe. All right, stand on up. Arm circles forward. I'm gonna keep them small. Reaching through those fingertips. Spread those shoulder blades apart. All right, now reverse, palms up, and now we're pinching the shoulder blades in the back. Good. All right, now we're gonna drop into a front lunge, just like our last workout, twisting over that front knee.
leaving those early morning back cracks out the way. Still strong through that posture, don't hunch over. Keep that chest up. Good, all right, heel scoops. One foot in front of the other, point that front toe up. Scoop the ground, arms above your head. And you're gonna alternate. Get a stretch in those shoulders at the top. All right, high kicks. Opposite hand, opposite toe. The slight bend in the knee is okay. Start to pick up the pace a little bit. I know it's early, but we gotta get that blood flowing. Takes a little bit longer in the morning. Start moving. High knee skips in place. Still nice and tall. Abs engaged when you're bringing those knees past the waistline. Ten seconds. Use those arms. out last one jumping jacks arms straight no bend in the elbow and touch those hands at the top make sure you're really bouncing off the balls of your feet get the lower part of your leg loose let's go 10 seconds Keep the arms straight. All right. Let's get started. Nice, easy warm up. Hopefully, you're not too winded. We're going to continue to start slow. First round, first Tabata is going to be a three by two. 20 seconds on, 15 seconds of rest. Starting with inchworms, keeping those legs straight, walking out to that push-up position, walking those hands back. If you want to add a push-up at the bottom, feel free. Part two, glute bridge march. So we're holding that glute bridge and kicking one leg out at a time. And part three, this is we'll grab either a dumbbell or a med ball, Russian twists, feet in the air, feet together, knees together, making sure we turn all the way to each side. All right. Let's get started. Inchworms. Start nice and slow. Don't rush that stretch. Feet shoulder width apart. Walk them out. Walk them back. And stand up in between. Only 20 seconds, so you can go a little faster. Try to keep those legs and heels down on the ground. Part two, loop bridge march. Keep that straight line from your knees to your shoulders the entire time. Go. Push that heel out and curl that toe back towards your head. Good. All right, Russian twist. Grab that weight. Keep 
Keep it right at chest height. Feet together, knees together. Go. I want more control for this first round. Got to get that back and the abs warmed up first, and then we can pick up the speed. Good. Back to the top, inchworms. Only doing two rounds, last round of these. If you're feeling loose, add that push up. Leg straight. All right, back down, Blue Bridge March. Let's pick up the pace now. And really flex that leg when you straighten it out. Flex the quad. Go. Curl that toe back as much as you can. Don't let the hip drop. And keep that foot flat. Good. All right, last one. Russian twist. Now we can pick up the speed. Should aim for 20 or more. Feet together and off the ground. Let's go. Poke that chest out. Keep the lower back straight. There we go. First round easy. Should be completely loose. All right, grab water, but we don't need a long break. But we do have a nice long round coming up. 30 by 15, four by three. So we'll need that dumbbell again. Dumbbell drag us. When you're in the push-up position, dragging the dumbbell from the opposite side to the same side you pulled with. Then we have a back lunge with a kick. I want everyone to start with their weaker side. And then on the next round, you go to your stronger side. And to finish, we'll grab a chair. We have dips, either a chair or a sturdy ledge on the couch that you can use, okay? But let's get started on that dumbbell drag. 30 by 15, four rounds or four movements. Three rounds. Let's get it. Go. Okay. Here we go. Pulling that dumbbell to each side. And we're only moving the arm. There's no rocking or twisting in the back or hips. Very strict in the abs. Abs are locked in, but we're continuing to breathe. Each rep. Good. Back lunge with a front kick. Starting with the weaker leg. In the first round, let's keep that form tight. It's going to take a lot of balance. If you need to kick and then touch in the middle, that's fine. We're kicking that leg out as far as we can. You want your balance thrown off. A little wobble is okay. Good. Shake it out. Other leg now. Keep 
Keeping that heel down on the front foot. Go. And as you drop back into that lunge, don't let yourself fall forward. Try to sink straight down. A few more. Nice and steady. Good. All right, dips. Either the legs out straight or knees bent. The knees are bent, that'll help you push back up. Go. Get that 90 degree angle in the elbow and fully extend back up. Gonna get a good stretch in that chest here. And we're strengthening the triceps. A little shoulder mobility. Good. All right, back to the top. Dumbbell drag. More reps, same technique. No movement in the hips. Go. Try to keep those hands directly underneath the shoulders. Almost there, steady the breathing. All right, stand on up. Back lunge kick. Starting with the weaker leg. Dropping straight down into that lunge, kicking straight back out. Staying in control and balanced through your core. Good, so focus on that breathing. Slow it down. Five seconds, take, take advantage of that recovery time. Go. Don't let that knee slam on the ground in that back lunge. Control of every movement. As we get tired, we don't get sloppy. Good. Back to dips. Definitely sweating now, so let's pick it up. Push a little harder. Earn it. Let's go. Breathe each rep. Ten seconds. Make them count. There we go. All right, third round. Last round of this circuit. Dumbbell drag. Finishing better than we started. Let's go. Should be feeling it in the upper back and behind the shoulder. All 
right, Donald Thomas. Weak side. Back lunge kick. Give me an extra rep or two. Getting better. And if you can, try to go straight from the kick to the back lunge. Last round, we gotta progress. Stay steady. One more. Good, shake them out. Other side. Three, two, one, let's go. Come on, guys. Improve. Don't slow up. Ten seconds. Got to keep it even with the other side. There we go. All right. Last one. Back to the dips. And then we'll get a break. Always getting better. Give me the extra rep. Let's go. Fifteen seconds. Where are you at? Are you close? Ten seconds now. Catch last round's number. Three, two. And one. Nice job. Woo. There we go. Grabbing water. Catching your breath. Slow it all down. Relax. We got one more long Tabata like that. 30-15. Four by three. Okay. No rush. So make sure you can hear me. All right. For this next one, we're gonna need the dumbbell, but we're gonna use it as a hurdle. Three steps on each side, getting those knees nice and high, getting that heart rate up. We're gonna rest, then we're gonna sit down on our butt, using the dumbbell again, V-sit leg over, springing both feet, keeping both feet together, up and over, not letting the heels touch. But if you do need a rest, you can drop them, but for no more than three seconds and you get back after it. Then we got skip knees, either a pillow or a med ball. And to finish, grabbing both dumbbells, uppercuts. All right, let's set up that first hurdle for the dumbbells. We're moving a little more movement, a little higher work right here, okay? Not gonna be moving as slow. Let's let's really push it here. Get that sweat going. All right. Dumbbells ready. Make sure you don't step on them. Get those knees up and step all the way over. Okay. Five seconds. Let's go. We're on the balls of our feet. Open those arms. Ten seconds. Good. Okay, we're on our butt. V-sit leg overs. You can post up on your hands behind you. We're keeping that lower back straight. It's not a crunch. Stick that chest out. Go. 
Bring those lower abs to work. During those ab exercises, it's hard to breathe. So slow it down and control with the breath. Good. Third part, skip knees, pillow, or dumbbell, I mean, or med ball. Stand tall and quick. Drive that knee up. Don't bring your hands down to the knee. Get your knee up to the ball. Good posture. Standing tall. Good. Okay, now you're grabbing both dumbbells. I don't want you moving or pivoting your feet. We're just throwing uppercuts. So mostly abs and biceps are working here. Go. But we're staying tight. Not big long punches. Keep them close. Ten seconds. Feet are cemented to the ground. Only using the hips and abs. Good. Back to hurdles. Covering that breath. Round two. Let's go. Last time on the ground. Come on, 10 seconds. Keep that pace, keep that rhythm. Good. Back on your butt. Instead of speed and reps, let's focus on keeping those feet up the whole 30. Control. We're in no rush here. Slow it down. Try to work every muscle you can, make it a little easier. Good. Skip knees. Back up. Let's go. Let's go. Hop up. Breaking that waistline. Let's go. Driving that knee straight through the middle. Not around to the outside. Right into the stomach or chest. Get him up. Good. Whopper cuts. Gonna go a little heavier with the dumbbells. But I'm gonna slow it down that way too. Legs are doing no work here. Throwing these punches from the abs. Just quick twist. Good. Let's do the last round. Back to hurdles. 
Last round, best round. Pick it up. No early breaks. Come on. Ten seconds. Get those knees up. Good. Back down for those abs. Try to keep those heels away from us. Pulling the toes towards the head. Go. Flex those feet. Ten seconds. Come on, stay up there. Keep those legs up. Feet together. Three, two, one. Skip knees. Keep that same work rate. Do not take it easy. Let's go. Ten seconds. Good. All right, let's finish on high note. Back those uppercuts. Roll the shoulders back. Get your base set. We're throwing these punches from the core and hips. Go. No pivot in the feet. Nice and tight. Find a good breathing rhythm too. Got 15 seconds. Five seconds. Three, two, one. All right. There we go, done with the Tabatas. But for those of you who saw what was next, getting excited, right? We're gonna finish with a 12 minute Imam. It is gonna be tough. It's definitely got the music, water, whatever you need to stay motivated and push through this one. We're gonna make this Sunday workout count. All right, first minute of the Imam, Imam is 50 shoulder taps. So Imam means you're getting those, that number done as fast as you can. The faster you get it done, the longer break you get. Okay, so first minute, 50 shoulder taps. No twisting of the hips. You already know who you are. Keep it tight, minute two. 40 squat jacks, had to bring those back. We're touching the ground, or alternating touching the ground with the opposite hand each time. Part three, or minute three, 30 switches, our wrestler switches, 15 each side. And to finish the round, or the, is 20 high kick skips. So we're touching that toe, and we're going as fast as we can, trying to keep that leg as straight as possible. All right? All right, let's dig deep, refocus, 12 hard minutes, get that music ready and loud, let's do it, 50 shoulder taps, okay, get down in that push-up position and get down and ready to go, no one's starting late, 50, Speed is up to you. 
Get a longer break that way, but stay technical. Thirty seconds. If you're done, focus on catching your breath. Take full advantage of that recovery time, because you're getting right back to work as soon as that bell goes off. Forty squat jacks, and we're squatting. We're not bending our back. Get that butt down, touch the ground. Twenty touches each hand. Forty total. Let's go. Ending with the feet flat, but bouncing off the balls of your feet. Soft knees. Keep those eyes up. Touch the ground. if you're still working keep fighting for it shake the legs out 30 switches now either on one hand or both up to you ready go today. Ah, 20 seconds left. 15. Get ready for that next one. Not much impact. We got to stay agile for those kicks. Stay loose. Ready? Go. Only 20, 10 each leg. It's not quite a break, just a little, little longer rest time before we get to those shoulder chaps. Remember, we got 50. And I don't want you getting them done faster if that means you're getting sloppy. Keep the hip. And back straight. No twisting. 10 seconds. Put the weight on your abs, not your shoulders. Let's go. 50 up. Stay square. But down. Thirty seconds. Pop up when you're done. You want to catch your breath while you're standing up. Fill that chest up. Get your oxygen back. Always working the lungs. Do it 10 seconds. Squat jacks. 40 of them. Soft knees. 
Get down there, squatting down. Go. Right on your feet. You done shake them out. And get right back. Just slowing your breath down. Refocus. Getting tough on the abs. 30 switches. I know we want to go fast, but we gotta be in control. Let's go. Twenty seconds. Where are you at? Hopefully you're up. Catching your breath. Back to high kicks. Find your rhythm. Let's go. Twenty. Ten each leg. Get that done. We got one more round. Let's recover. Last round, best round. Let's do it. Get down there. 50 shoulder taps. I want everybody to fight to get it done in 30 seconds. Give yourself a good break. Let's stay technical. Ready. Let's go. Thirty seconds. Better be done. No excuse right now. We're loose. Let's get those forty squat jacks done in thirty-two. If not, no big deal. We're working hard. True to form. Squatting down. Let's go. Get that butt down. Close. Woo. No more. No more of those. Nothing to worry about. You won't have to see those again. But we do have switches. Let's go. Ten seconds. Thirty of them. Control. Keep it tight. 
Nobody falling over. Let's go. Twenty seconds. Stand on up. Last minute. Twenty high kicks. You know what? Instead of that, we're going thirty seconds. All the way through for thirty seconds. Come on. Last one. Let's go. You find a rhythm you can keep for thirty. Get that leg up and reach for it. Ten seconds. Time. Woo. That is it, guys. That is it. Nice job. <laughs>